Ah, oh, so time now to introduce you, reintroduce you to our musical guests. They've been gone for so long that we've forgotten who they are. <laughs> Anecdotes are in the house, guys. We love you, man. Aww. We absolutely love Thank you. you. Your sound check was sounding a little bit shaky, but hopefully you're gonna, you're gonna come right. No, we're in awe, jaws just drop, and it's not just how good you are, but it's the, the choices, those creative choices with the kinds of songs that you do, guys. You're gonna love it, you're gonna love it today. But um, let's bring you back down to earth, first of all, with a little game of rapid fire. First impressions are vitally important, okay? You can't just always rely. Did you just all groan in harmony there? <laughs> Do you even, even talk in harmony? This is ridiculous, man. So um, we're going to start with you, Monet. We're going to work down to you, Dan. We're going to do rapid fire. You've got to answer these questions truthfully. Yeah. Right. And I have a commitment <laughs> to being honest. Okay. Um, no, they're not tough. They're not tough. We're just going to find out who you really are. Anecdote, are you ready yes. for the challenge? Yes, us. <sighs> in three, two, one. Morning person or night owl? Morning person. Uh, Favourite word? Don't. Don't roll. Your alarm goes off. Do you snooze or do you get up? Ah, uh, snooze. Mm. John Travolta or Patrick Swayze? John Travolta. Peanut butter, crunchy or smooth, Dan? Crunchy. Absolutely. What are cats or dogs? Dogs. Ryan Reynolds or Gosling? Gosling. Oh. Pitch perfect one or two? One, definitely. TV or books? TV. Bungee mm. jump or abseiling? <laughs> Bungee jump. <laughs> Favorite sport team? South Africa. <laughs> in anything, in anything, good answer. Taylor Swift or Kanye West? Uh, Kanye West. Yes. Most used emoji? Ooh, just a smiley. Aww. <laughs> uh, Beyonce or Adele? Beyonce. Ooh, wow. Friends or Big Bang Theory? Friends. Old school. Get out. Get out. <laughs> uh, One yeah, Direction out. or Westlife? <laughs> One Direction. 60s or 90s? 90s. Always early or always late? Uh, always late. Is that you personally or the whole group? <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm going to give you all the opportunity to answer this because it's just, it's really important for me to know this. Your best karaoke song? <sighs> Staying Alive by the Bee Gees. Oh, that's <laughs> Fire, firework for Katy Perry. <laughs> Angels by Robbie Williams. I will always love you with me. Oh, oh, oh okay. You can actually <laughs> sing it. That's, that's always a, a thing. Monet? Your man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, baby. Yeah, yeah. In case you miss it, he brings the bass <laughs> yeah, to this little act. Guys, where have you been? What's going on? And you, uh, you guys shot to fame, obviously, with an incredible opportunity, but you've grabbed that. You've done some amazing things. We just want albums from you. We want performances from you. Monet, maybe you can fill us in. How are you guys doing, Jeez, first of all? And, and where have you been since the last time we've seen you, man? So we've been, we've been working on quite a bit few new arrangements yeah. at the moment, keeping things going, yeah. um, keeping our spirits up, keeping the vibe going. Um, we have a few gigs lined up as well. Mm. I don't know, Dan. Oh, You're right. like the hot man, dude. You're like, <laughs> <laughs> You're talking morning people. I'm like, I'm here, I'm here. <laughs> <laughs> no, the big thing is we got a nice gig at Cafe Rue this Friday. Nice. Mm. Everybody must come, bring your people, bring your people's people. And um, what we've also been doing this year is just trying to network with the acapella community worldwide. We've Absolutely. met some really interesting people in Africa and beyond. And we're just trying to grow that profile. We said it years ago, no matter what it's going to be, we want an acapella to be mainstream. Yeah, yeah man, I, 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 but I get a sense that you guys are going to become an academy at some point. Oh. Just, oh. just there's a sense yeah. of learning. Academy. But the most important thing for me is, and you talk about new arrangements, there is something about the work that you guys do. You keep it fresh, you keep it current. How do you even go about selecting? Who makes the final choice here? And I'm looking to see you. No, don't look at me. <laughs> no, I look at Amy. Amy. It's yeah. not me. No lie. It's no. We, the boss. Own it. We, <laughs> we come with ideas and arrangements, and um, everybody decides together. Yeah. So Kevin will come and say, "I've heard this song. I've been working on it. Do you want to? Should I continue with it?" And yeah. we'll say yes or. No, it's usually yeah. yes. It's usually, it's usually yes. yes. Yeah. So yeah, so I it's get, a, it's I a get method. Nose, I was going to ask, who's the crazy person? <laughs> <laughs> Who comes with these arrangements? Everyone else is like, guys, yeah, that's <laughs> great, buddy. Well that's the childish that. Gambino. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, that was a thing. <laughs> can, you, can I pass a fist bump all the way up? Pass it down. Pass it all the way down to him. Come on, thank you, man. Oh, guys, we love you, man. And, and I wasn't kidding. The, the arrangements really are the best part about having you. As much as we love you, um, your music, your talent is, is what we love the most. So thank you so much for coming Thanks, and blessing thank us you. with that. Um, um, but don't forget, you can see them at Cafe Rue this Friday. Yes, sir. Yes. Um, this Friday. And you have to see them live to truly take it all in. They are awesome. You're going to get an opportunity to take it all in live on the show, so stick around.